Segways have come a long way since the days of Paul Blart. The company's latest creation combines their existing person-carrying technology with cutting-edge robotics to create a two-wheeled transport that not only delivers you to your destination, but will also follow you home while carrying your bags. Say hello to the Lumo. Hi there, my name is Lumo, and I have been waiting a long time to meet you. The Lumo is basically a robot that you ride. You step onto it, lean forward to accelerate, lean back to brake, and you actually steer with your knees. And it's surprisingly stable and really easy to get used to. It only took me a couple of minutes to get really comfortable riding it around. But like any good transformer, there's more to the Lumo than meets the eye. Once you step off the device, you can either pat it on its head or simply tell it to transform, and the Lumo will convert itself into a companion robot. Lumo, transform. In robot mode, it will follow you around, listen to your commands, uh, take photos, take video, and even use text-to-speech synthesizers. Okay, Lumo, take a photo. Uh, wow, you look shy. <laughs> I have got a perfect angle. Ready? Three, two, one, cheese. There's also a companion app that comes with it that allows you to do all of this stuff as well, as well as remotely control it as sort of a friendly security bot. Think of a night bot, but, but cuter. The Lumo is pretty versatile as well. It's got a top speed of about 11 miles an hour, a maximum range of about 20 miles an hour, and can hold up to around 200 pounds. Uh, it supported me pretty well, so there you go. The Lumo is able to follow you around so easily because there are a series of cameras and sensors embedded throughout its structure that learn both your face and your body type, enabling it to differentiate you from other people in the crowd. Now the Lumo isn't quite perfect yet because it is still pre-production. It does get confused a little bit when there are a lot of people in the room and it's trying to track you around. And the voice commands are a little hit and miss at this point, but the company is sure that with future updates to the software, those bugs will get worked out. The Lumo is going to retail for about $1,800, but when it goes on sale on March 6th on Indiegogo, early adopters can get a discount on that price. $1,800 can seem a bit pricey for what's essentially a robotic hoverboard. But compared to other means of mechanical transportation like the One Wheel Plus or, or the Uniwheel, none of those are nearly as capable as the Lumo, and none of them are nearly as endearing. Okay, Lumo. Let's go.